Like, oh, fuck. She was like, she was an English teacher, but fucking, she said, uh, like, we had to do, uh, internet, with so producing out the internet. She's like, What did she mean by two internets? What the fuck was there to use she other didn't. than internet? Oh, for, um, it wasn't two internets, but she says, no internets or something. <laughs> and then with whatever Walmart or whatever, if they don't know, I do Walmart. Walmart. <laughs> Walmart? Wasn't that her, what was your fucking name? It's Wall something? Walmart. Wait, how do you spell it? Oh, Rob Meyer. I think it's a Walmart. Oh, no. Fucking. Uh, fucking. What? Lob Meyer, right, whatever. So, yeah. again, uh, in, um. Fifth grade, I had a teacher named, um. Mrs. Rhodes. And fucking, uh, -huh. uh. Like. Some. You wouldn't even actually see her doing it because it was, like, close in her hands, but. I think she was eating chalk. Like, I think she ate chalk, because it's fucking. I saw her snap on a piece of chalk. And I didn't tell anybody, but I was like, what the fuck? Is she ate chalk? <laughs> <laughs> she was probably eating and those fucking. Those eatable. The edible fucking candy chalks, the Spider Man chalks and shit. <laughs> no, because it was like fucking yellow sticks. And she used yellow sticks. Ugh. Wait, is it chalk edible? First of all, why would your teacher use chalk? What the fuck happened to fucking fucking well, the Public school. What the fuck? We, we only had one teacher that had a goddamn whiteboard, and she was the youngest teacher there. <laughs> if you don't know, I don't know why the hell. How uh, do you use a whiteboard? Come on out. <laughs> I can imagine her as that fat old lady from fucking recess. No, she's That's right, bitch. Like, but she's fucking tall as hell. <laughs> I could draft. Yeah, kind of. She had blonde hair and everything, but yeah, that's because it's weird because like she's um, <laughs> dated, and when she smiles, her like lips kind of like show the top of her thumbs, which is kind of weird. Ooh. That's how my teacher smiled. That was a lot more smiled. Oh, so I imagine her being like the woman version of Gabe. So like, put a fucking no. yellow wig on Gabe Newell. That's all I meant. No. She's fucking tall. But with She's a strong kick. He's in big house, guys. He's in white. Big white. She sounds fucking, fucking fat. Jesus Christ. She sounds like a fucking me. I have no idea what she said. With that fucking voice. If you don't know, huh? by now. <laughs> but I have no clue what you just said. Speak English. Just like a million and one. No fucking, okay. So this one teacher. What, what, what was your first year teacher like? Did you like her? Or what, she, she was weird. She was a fucking bitch. Her name was Miss Fadia or some shit, but me and my friend made fun of her. Miss Kessid. Yeah. Me and my friend made fun of her. It was like Miss Kessidia and shit. <laughs> We saw her underwear once, so. Oh. You know, cause like, fucking teachers wear skirts and shit or whatever. And then I saw, like, she had her legs crossed. I saw, like, like zombie shit. So fucking OP. So OP. Fucking, I had this first good, my first good teacher. What about his And fucking, she get pissed. Who knows the big house over? Fucking, she, uh, He's going out towards Big Red. Go, guys. Hey, wait, wait, what, Marty? Well, I, I didn't quite hear you. The Al Capone was talking like an asshole. Oh, fucking so my teacher. He's going back in the Big White. Al Capone, come on, man. Your mic's so loud. Just, just, just. Get the fuck out of here. Okay. Okay, so I fucking need the game. Okay, anyway. So 
also, my first grade teacher, Miss McGee, she was weird as hell. Like, there's one time we were drawing pictures of animals and coloring them. And there was a Die, you fucking whore! Right? And she's like, Alright, guys. You want a big red? <laughs> I'm gonna I colored it black and I was like, alright, I colored it. She's like, oh my god. I want to feel the wax of the white. I didn't fucking color a white and I got pissed off. Oh my fucking. Oh my god. Oh, uh, dude, have I have a story for you? Uh, have I have a story for you? Alright, well, hold on. I still got, I got, st I got still some more Miss McGee things where she get pissed over like little things like fucking. Uh, Yes, we were. Did you ever use chips? Like, like a little white or red and yellow? Like, oh, the yeah, and then the blue and see through and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there was one time there was a kid using them as like as he was playing it like he was playing guitar, and she got all pissed off. She's like, "Hey, see my class, see my class, you're gonna touch it, see my class." Fucking, he wasn't even doing it. He was just fucking sitting there. Bro, that's a feat. Come on, raw. It's a pretty decent match. Oh, that one time? Well, last year? Um... I had a teacher Five. called the district court. Or better. And he just, he's like this typical Jew. Oh, Kevin, I'll break that. Yeah, like, like, oh, whatever. No, so, wait, please. My teacher, Mr. Gordon, he had like a super fucking big nose. You probably mistake him for the fucking toucan from Fruity Loops. Or whatever. Fruity Loops? Okay, I'll call Fruity Loops. Whatever. Fruity Loops? Or whatever. <laughs> okay. And then. And it'd be nasty because he'd always get mad. Dude. Like, he'd fucking spend 30 fucking minutes of the class, like the whole class. The whole class period of explaining why you should pass class and shit, and we'd never get work done. Absolutely, never. We'd never get work done. And he's like, so yeah, this is why you guys should fucking pass. If you don't pass, you're gonna be a bum working at McDonald's. A bum. <laughs> yeah, he said. He said that shit, dude. And then the nastiest part. Then the nastiest part of him. You know how sometimes you get stuff stuck in your teeth. And then like, yeah. he'd, like he he he'd get stuff in his teeth. He'd dig it out. He'd look at it, and he'd fucking eat it. The fuck? <laughs> I know. <laughs> but and then there was one other time, where, like sometimes he scratches his balls, <laughs> scratches the front of his students. <laughs> but he tried to like be slick with it. So like he tried to put his hands oh, yeah. in his pocket. And he'd scratch, and then he'd try to like pull it off and pull it out and make it look like he was a bro. But this one time, there was nothing for him to pull out in his pocket, so he just pulled out a pen, and he was just looking at it, and he put it back in. <laughs> like, yeah, fucking looking at pens is so fucking interesting. Like, dude, like, it's so fucking nasty, you know? it's just him fucking scratching his balls and shit. Like, I probably, I probably thought that, like, he probably keeps that fucking, all that nut fucking dust or some shit, all that nut dandruff and shit. Nut dandruff and shit, puts in a little jar, keeps it for himself, and probably sniffs it all day and shit. Fucking, probably sniffs it, whatever. Like, he eats that leftover fucking food in his jaws and shit. Alright, so, um, nasty. the only male teachers I've ever had were for computer classes, and uh, the first one I had was when I was like, in the lower classes, like, kindergarten, first grade, and fucking, um, what's his name? His name was Mr. Dell, and he didn't teach it, he did, like, the only thing he taught us to do was go and fucking Lego stuff on, and play that in games. Bullshit, dude! <laughs> Wow, did he really just laugh like that? Just for doing it? He was just the stupidest kind of thing. Like, we're gonna do a spreadsheet. Of, uh, what a faggot. His, his meal plan was at his work or something. It was fucking boring as hell. And fucking. Like, three of my friends, not including me, they copied each other's work. And they all got in trouble for it, right? Like, after that, they all started having fun. Well, we're not gonna say it, but we said, like, like, like alright, so we're starting for today's class, just to fuck all of my daughters, because they had, like, three <laughs> other fucking daughters that went to school, they're like, 
to you and I fuck all of them like a hundred percent. Oh fucking um there's yeah. this one uh, YouTube commenter on, on YouTube obviously. Like, his name is Optic Hex, right? He does a call yeah. duty videos and everything. And <laughs> you know, I don't know if you heard him but his voice is like, alright, this is Optic Hex signing out. So, <laughs> yeah. And so my uh my teacher's name was um Hex Thomas, right? <laughs> <laughs> so, we used to call him um, Optic Hex Ramos, and he's like, it's whatever, like, yeah. the last band you would hear someone say, yes, Optic Hex, it's like, I mean, you know. <laughs> oh, it's like, oh, oh man. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> I can imagine him saying that with some fucking, you know, shades on and shit. <laughs> like looking like a Mexican Fonzie and shit. Yeah, yeah, he's just kind of like Mexican. Oh, 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 damn. What about you, Chris? Did you guys have any funny teacher story? No, I guess I some fucking funny more ones. <laughs> So he would say, alright, take out your USB drives and put slot A, or if he's like, put the A drive in the slot B or something like that. And somebody, you'd hear somebody in the back room say, oh, like, like, something like that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'll try to think of something else, but you guys think of something. I mean, I thought I had a freaking Mr. Gordon, Ms. Padilla. Oh, okay, I have not It's not like the teachers, but it's like a, a, a student thing where I think it was like in fourth grade, maybe. There, my friend Marshall, he and I were playing like, and there was this other kid named. He had like this weird ass bolt and everything, and fucking. Um, there was one time we were on the basketball court, right? And he started like rubbing his nuts on like, the poles. And so, uh, this other kid, he's like, Oh, look at Dakota, he's rubbing his nuts on the poles. And my friend Mark and I, we, were gonna, we, we didn't like touch any of the poles for like the rest of the year. We were like, oh my god, he touched the pole, he touched the pole. And so, like the whole year, we were just like, so, we, like, if there was a big flight of stairs, we would just like not touch the pole. You can imagine fucking people in biohazard suits and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Do not touch the pole. Can that kid it? Like, um. I mean, I guess. I, I guess I have the same story. Where. Okay. My friend, he had a brother, right? He was, uh, he had, he was autistic. And he had like, he had like a black guy voice. But he was next to him. He talked like this! You know what I'm saying? And he was like 11 or some shit. And he'd always see hot cheetos and shit. And like, I guess that kind of made his voice even worse. He kind of talks like this, like an old man about to die. That's black or something. You know? And then there yeah. was this one time, it, he loved turtles. He fucking loved turtles. Like, he had this fucking fetish for turtles. He was the Quentin Tarantino of turtles, dude. But, like, this one time, me and my brother and some other friends, we got near this turtle, and all of a sudden you hear in the background, Hey, bitch, get back this. my turtle! This place doesn't look right. <laughs> <laughs> Why did he say that? <laughs> I don't know. That's all I heard. <laughs> He called him a bitch nigga? Yeah, he actually said bitch nigga. <laughs> <laughs> One of us! One of us!